Prince George is already learning to fly, having taken his first trip in the air on the final day of his school summer holidays. According to the Sun, the future king loved his maiden flight on the White Waltham airfield near Maidenhead. Reports suggest the Prince and Princess of Wales watched the 11-year-old take off from the runway with an instructor and come back to land safely just under an hour later. William and Kate had turned up with George in a three-car convoy at the Berkshire airfield, a 10-mile drive from their Windsor home. After the flight was complete, all three royals are said to have relaxed at the airfield's clubhouse, home to the West London Aero Club. An onlooker said, George is only 11 years old but it is the right time to start. The royal family has a proud tradition of flying and it looks like George is next in line. His parents watched George take flight from the safety of the ground but he flew with an instructor and loved it. One person at the airfield said there was 30 or 40 people in the clubhouse whilst William, Kate and George were there, adding that all three had been pretty chilled. Pilots can start learning to fly at any age but training hours that count towards a license start from the age of 14. Students must be accompanied by an instructor until age 16, after which they can be sent solo. Under the guidance to obtain a private pilot license from the Civil Aviation Authority, Pupils must be guided through a minimum of 45 flying hours and pass 9 theoretical exams. Pilots can hold a license and carry passengers from age 17. George will look to follow in the footsteps of his many family members who have piloted aircraft throughout history. His father William is a trained helicopter pilot who has flown for RAF search and rescue in East Anglia Air Ambulance, while his great-grandfather Prince Philip trained at the same Maidenhead airfield. Philip was 31 when he began his flying training at White Waltham in November 1952, before continuing in the North American Harvard. At a private ceremony at Buckingham Palace in May 1953, the Duke of Edinburgh was awarded his wings by Chief of the Air Staff Air Chief Marshal Sir William Dixon. His sons William and Harry were both in the Army Cadet Corps at Eton College and did not get flying lessons until they were in the military. William then started an intensive training program with the RAF in 2009, learning how to fly fixed-wing aircrafts and helicopters at the age of 27. 